Welcome back, everyone. And I do mean everyone. It's Forgotten Circus. So, yeah, I'm going to say it. Uh, three body problem. Yeah. Three body problem. Now, l let me tell you, people, I was avoiding this like the plague. As soon as I saw Benny Hoff and Weiss, I got a bad taste in my mouth from Game of Thrones. But I was like, I I'll put it off. But, you know, I have, I was talking to a friend, friend of mine. And mind you, this, this friend that I'm talking about literally watches no TV shows, watches movies every once in a while. It's all about sports. All this dude watches is sports. That's it. And we we was having a conversation, man. We was having a conversation. I was just normal stuff. We was talking about, you know, the team. I'm, I'm going to say it. The Philadelphia Eagles fly. Eagles fly. You know what I mean? Fish got to swim. Birds got to eat. But, uh, yeah, and out of nowhere, like, we we're about to finish the conversation, get off the phone, you know, usually just uh, shooting the shit. And then he was like, oh, yeah, so I, 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 I got to watch the uh, three-body problem. And I was like, oh, oh, really? You watched it? And he was like, yeah, yeah, it's good. I liked it. And then I was like, oh, that, that's what's up. And then he was like, yeah. But I know you already seen it, so, you know, you could probably tell me about it. And I was like, and I was in my head, bro, when he said that. I was like, oh, shit. And I'm thinking in my head, he's like, I'm thinking in my head, like, I don't see that shit, but uh, yeah. <laughs> so I'm sitting there like, yeah, yeah, yeah. He's like, he's like, yeah, yeah. Knowing damn full well that I did not watch it. <laughs> and now that he watched it, I was like, yo, I'm going to, I'm going to check it out. So I put it on. Now, mind you, I'm only, I'm only in the first episode though. Only in the first episode. So, but I, I, I was pleasantly surprised. When I sat down and watched it, I was like, this is crazy. And it's so up my alley because um, I don't want to spoil it for anybody. I'm a little late to the party, but I'm on board. So I'm going to be doing more videos about um, three body problem. So. And I was like, damn, I watched it. And I was like, oh, my gosh, hold up. I started making excuses in my head for a guy. I always talk trash about Benny Off and Weiss. But at the, when, when I actually watched the episode, and I'll talk a little bit more about the episode, but when I actually watched I started making excuses for him. Like, in my head, I was like, oh, well, you know, you know, season seven and eight technically was the day fault. I know they had the Star Wars deal coming up. and Everybody thinks they rushed it. But let's be honest here. Like George R. R. Martin didn't finish the books that they needed. So they had to actually, you know, like make it up themselves, man. And it was like crunch time for them. And, you know, I was sitting there like making excuses for him. Like, yo, this is, see, yeah, and then Star Wars, Disney, y'all messed up. Y'all lost the real one on that. For real. Man. They don't deserve, they don't deserve y'all. You know, but still, I'm I'm still mad at them. It's going to take a while, but I'll, I'll give them this. It is it, it's a well done. Now, this could be the pilot episode. So if you know anything about TV shows and you're watching this video, you definitely know about film and uh, how, how it works. The pilot, the pilot episode is always the bang. I think it's actually bigger than the finale of like a series or or a season you know the pilot episode that's what when you are trying to sell the product to the distributors and whoever wants to purchase the rights to that so i gotta leave that in account because mind you what i said i'm only one one episode in but i i did like the whole it had so many twists and turns and I don't want to put too much spoilers because I don't know. I don't know too much about it, but apparently it's from a novel. So then I started researching because, you know, after I watched it and I liked it, I was like, let me research. What is three body problem? And I'll let you know. I'll let you know. Like, I'm all about UA, UFOs, UAPs. Man, they took UFO from us. Mm, now it's UAP. Okay. Hashtag bring back UFO. 
But then I started researching what does that mean? So I'm going to read this short segment to you real quick. So uh, in physics, the three body problem refers to the motion of three bodies trapped in each other's gravitational grip. Well, that's the case. And that's for real. I've been doing this since circa 1981. Or you can say in the year of our Lord, 1981. I'm pretty sure I got a three body three body problem going on. Definitely. The motion of three bodies trapped in each other's gravitational grip. Yep, that sums it up. <laughs> it's so intriguing. It's so interesting. Like what I saw. And I could leave it at that one episode. I'm good. Mm. I guess the universe will wink back. Yeah, spoiler, kind of. But I'm I'm surprised on how like shows like this sometimes they change the game up. I don't know if this one will because I'm not all the way in. I'm pretty sure a lot of people have already seen it. But I need somebody to explain some stuff to me because like there's in the first episode, I'm already like, what the, 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 who the wait. So China had it. And then, and there's a lot of things that, that are in that because I am a former military, you know, um, that I've seen concepts of certain things like in the, in this video, I don't, I don't want to say too much, you know, but. I just, I just like the, I like the flow of it. I like how they place every story for every person person, like perfectly, but you still have some that you need to learn about a little bit more, but, um, the acting's good. And I like the flashbacks to jump it back perfectly. It's not like, um, first season of the Witcher where, it, which was great. The first episode, actually, you're like, wait, where are we going? Where are we? But I like how they're jumping back and forth. It kind of, why does it feel like it's like the, I, oh, and it's from a novel. So, like, and that's another thing, too. Like, um, Benny Hoff and Weiss, they put in the, like, they, they wrote and everything. It, it's adapted from a novel. We've seen you do this before. Okay. Let's stay in the pace of the actual novel, not outpace it. Because that's kind of what happened with uh, Game of Thrones. You outpaced it, and it's not all your fault. It's not. See, see, I'm being, I'm being nice now with those two. After seeing this, I'm being nice. I'm just saying it was probably like sixty-five percent of their fault, maybe seventy. You know, and the other rest was uh, George George R. R. Martin. But oh, it, tell me if you've seen it. Tell me in the comments. Tell me if you think it's good or not. Like you don't spoil it though. Don't spoil it. Cause I want to do more videos of it. And, um, I'm just, I just want to know deeper into this. Cause obviously it's dealing with aliens. I knew that from the rip. As soon as I kept saying like, look at, look at the stars. I do that all the time. I, I, I love outer space and UFOs. My favorite song is fly me to the moon by Frank Sinatra. You know? So, I just, I just want to know, cause I already knew that I was probably sending out, like, I'm going to spoil a little bit. That dish was definitely sending out some type of waves. Now I was like, I, I already know there, where this is going, but I'm in a good way. But yeah, I don't know. Kind of rambled on a little bit about that, but anyway, tell me what you think. Like, comment, and subscribe. It takes one little click. I want everyone to subscribe. Come on, man. Everybody subscribe. Let's get to 1k. Everyone, and I do mean everyone.